Hey everybody, this is Maury Beck, Wonder Work California. Uh, thanks for joining us today. I'm here with Mike. Mike, you want to say hello for a second? Yeah, hello everyone. Yeah, hi. All right. So uh, today we're going to talk about where do people use SCADA? That's a question we hear all the time for our customer base. And um, I don't know, Mike, can you help answer that for us? Yeah, thanks Maury. And yeah, we see lots of different size SCADA applications in the field from small to medium sized SCADA systems that range from a single workstation monitoring one or two processes to multiple workstations or servers monitoring an entire site or plant. And then we see large and enterprise SCADA systems that monitor multiple plants or a large number of distributed assets. And these systems typically have a unified operations center for central command and control that include high level dashboards with the ability to drill down into local processes as well as the integration with other operations applications such as video, logbooks, and work tasks. That's great, thank you, Mike, appreciate that. Yeah, sure thing. So Maury, what should people consider when selecting the right SCADA system for them? Yeah, that's a great question. I mean, we, we hear this all the time. I mean, some of the concepts that people should, you know, think through first or, you know, what's the size and scope of their application? Is it just an HMI? Is it a plant SCADA? is an enterprise-wide monitoring control. I mean, if you look at the screens behind Mike and myself, you know, you have some different versions of what people might go through. You know, the other considerations too, when they're, when they're choosing is, what's your existing footprint? You know, what do you have in place? What solutions are there already? What does that mean for your business to, to use the same solution or maybe change? Then another big concept we hear these days, and, and this is a really one of the first decision points for folks is, you know, what am I looking at? Am I looking at just good enough and make it work? You know, do I need just a simple SCADA system and, you know, just I got to make something work and move on to my next task? Or am I really looking for best of breed around some of those things? And when we're looking at best of breed, what does that mean? Are we trying to implement corporate standards? Do I want templates? How about advanced security, advanced visualization? Am I looking at leading edge technology? You know, some of the other concepts folks are thinking about these days too is, who's gonna be implementing my SCADA system and who's gonna support my SCADA system? I mean, those are really critical questions. And then the last thing you really wanna consider, what's my future vision? Do I have a roadmap beyond SCADA, right? I mean, SCADA doesn't live in isolation these days and we see that everywhere. And it's a piece of the puzzle. It's a piece of your enter enterprise-wide infrastructure. You gotta be thinking, what am I doing? What else am I gonna be doing with SCADA and where is it taking me? So. So Mike, can you uh, help us out here? What does is, what is Aviva offer, maybe from a high level? Like what are the different choices that are there? Yeah, yeah, sure thing. So Aviva offers several market leading SCADA systems and you really can't go wrong with any of them as they all offer the reliability, functionality and support you need when it comes to SCADA. Aviva Edge is an easy to use cost effective SCADA platform with a built in web server and options for unlimited clients. You can't go wrong with Edge for HMIs and small to medium sized SCADA. InTouch and SciTech plant SCADA are also incredibly easy to use, extremely well known and supported in the market, and have a great future for existing customers. So InTouch is also an excellent choice for small to medium sized SCADA. Maury, how about System Platform? Can you share us with, tell us a little bit about Aviva System Platform? Yeah, for sure. I mean, uh, System Platform has been around for quite a while, so it's not a new technology. Uh, one of the, pl the place where we see it the most is large to up to enterprise type operations activity. You know, it has very advanced functionality and visualization called OMI. You've probably heard from that for most of it these days. That stands for Operations Management Interface. If you're looking at standards or templating or really driving, enforcing these kinds of concepts, it's a great tool for that. It's got best in class security with fully encrypted communication. And it's your vision for the future. Again, if you're looking to get beyond just what can SCADA do for me, and I think in today's world, it's something you really need to consider. System platform is definitely a great choice to consider. How about uh, InTouch and SciTech and those things, Mike? Can you help the customers with that as well? Yeah, absolutely. So InTouch and SciTech are solid SCADA platforms that are here to stay with legendary ease of use and best-in-class support. So to summarize, InTouch and SciTech plant SCADA are solid SCADA platforms that are here to stay with legendary ease of use and best-in-class support. If you're getting started with SCADA, you're looking for simple, you're looking for cost effective, you can't go wrong with Aviva Edge. And you want, when you want the best of breed and you're looking for enterprise capabilities, system platform is definitely the right selection. And if you're not sure which SCADA platform is best for you, we'd love to talk with you about your short-term and long-term needs and help you give you a roadmap for success for the short-term and the future. 
Awesome. Hey, thank you, Mike. And thank you, everybody, for listening. We'd love to help you out again. We'll be, as Mike mentioned, we'd be glad to go through any of this in any level of detail, help you make the right choice. So hope you're all doing well, and we'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Thanks, all.